So then after you do this, you click forgot, right? Then you click next and then follow the steps. All right, everybody, I'm not gonna waste your time like other people do with clickbaits. This is a real video. All you need is a cell phone or an iPad. If you forgot your Apple ID or your password, and, and we're really talking about your password, and you're locked out, you really can't do nothing. This is your final solution, final step, without using iTunes or anything. So all you gotta do is oh, find somebody, borrow a phone, your mom's, your dad's, or your, your, your husband's or wife's, Find my phone, put your Apple ID in, and then click, let me do this for you, right quick, my phone's dying, and the Apple, the iPad is dying here. So, then, after you do this, you click forgot, right? Then, you click next, and then follow the steps, and you can unlock your cell phone. You may need a, a cell phone, the number you use to create this Apple ID account. Okay, so don't forget, if you forget that number, you may be out of luck. You might have to take it in. Or use iTunes, which I'm gonna show you how to do in a second. So this Apple ID is important. If you remember that and you remember the, oh, it died. So just follow the instruction here and you're gonna reset your passcode. Real easy to do. Okay, so. Yeah. If you forgot your Apple ID or you bought this device off of somebody or you just, you know, you don't know or you just locked out, right? Unfortunately, you need a MacBook Air and you need iTunes, okay? Now, that's what sucks about Apple products. You got to remember, this is, and I'm, I tell this to my kids, you got to remember your... Apple ID. If you forget your Apple ID and your Apple passcode, you're done. A lot of times you can't even restart this. You got to take it in and all that, and it's going to cost you a bunch of money. So if you're trying to buy a product like this, you need a passcode. The owner needs to unlock this device. Now it's possible to do it. See, I'm doing a factory restart. I have a MacBook Air and I can do a factory reset in the iTunes. All you gotta do is connect it and I'll show you how to do this. And you can restart this. So all you gotta do, if you're locked out, you're, you forgot your passcode, unfortunately you have to restart your iPad. That's why I tell everybody again, remember your Apple ID. Anyway, so what, all you got to do is connect your iPad or your cell phone to a computer like this, an Apple Air. You need iTunes. Once you log into your iTunes, when you plug this in, you'll have this iPad showing up right here. You click on it. Click Factory Reset. So you're going to hold the power button and the home button at the same time. And then when the apple shows up, just hold the home button. And then it should show up in your iTunes that you're connected. Boom. There we go. Mm -hmm. 